welcome to Apsi Tutorial No Code Platform. Today we are going to know about the function called sum. This sum function is used to sum these selected values. Here we should select a column to sum the values of that column. It has only one argument that is the column with numerical type. For example, sum the values of price column from the products table. The return value of the function would be the sum of all values in the column. Let's see an example in our app. Create a virtual column and name that column as sum. And enter this formula sum of quantity from books table. Then save this. Here you can see the values sum of the quantity column. It is a simple example for how the sum function works. Let me show you an inventory management application as example. For inventory management, you need to add and edit the details of purchase and sales. Instead of writing manually, we can just enter the details here. Here is the order table where we enter the details of the orders. Click add here. This opens in a form type. To enter the details, click the book to select the books. It shows like this. We can choose one or more books here, then click done. Next, enter the quantity of books. This order details shows the details of the books that we selected in the order book. This cost shows the sum of cost of books selected. This total cost shows the value of cost with the quantity. Now, let me show you how it is done. Here, in this book name, choose the data type as enum list. And select the base type as the reference. And select the source table as books. In the data validity, give book name column for books table. Then click done and save. Add a virtual column and give the app formula as sum of these two formulas. In the previous example of sum function, we added the values from one column here we are adding values from two column. Then create a virtual column for total cost. Then give this formula to show the total cost of the order. Then click done and save. This is a simple example. You can use these functions to any complex situations to make it easier. I hope you have learned about some function. If you guys have any doubts or suggestions, tell us in the comment section. Thanks for watching. Please do share the video and subscribe our channel. Thank you.